If you look at the studies, one bad night's sleep increases a protein in the brain that is equal to a traumatic brain injury. So the brain is experiencing the lack of sleep as though it were harmed in a significant way. A few things with this video that I think are correct and then a few things that I think lead slightly more towards fear mongering. So I don't think it's the case that they're saying that you will see neuronal cell death the same way that you would from a, from a TBI, traumatic brain injury, uh, the same way as losing four hours of sleep. It is definitely important to, for you to be sleeping well and for you to be consistently getting that sleep. But to then try and draw a line to say one bad night's sleep is similar to a traumatic brain injury is completely incorrect. Mm -hmm. There are far more things at play when we have uh, traumatic brain injuries or strokes, things like that, that uh, impact on neuronal health. So, yeah, sleep is important. It's important to promote that uh, as a good, healthy practice. But telling people that, you know, one bad night's sleep might be the same as uh, having a TBI is likely to cause them just anxiety and worry, which ironically are two things that are most likely to stop you from being able to sleep in the first place.